It's time once again for The Law and You at Home. Joining us today, we have attorneys Ed Saramboli and Greg Fellerman. Great to see you both. Well, looking forward to seeing you in the studio, <laughs> Haley. It can't come soon enough. Hopefully it does come soon, though. We look forward to that day and when things get back to normal. But luckily, we still have you virtually giving us legal advice and answering our viewer questions like this one. This comes from Mindy in Bloomsburg. She's asking... I was pushing my cart back to my car after shopping and I stepped in a pothole and broke my ankle. I didn't see it, but I am an essential worker and was working at the time. Do I have a case? Uh, so it de really depends. I mean, you got a lot going on there. Uh, that you don't really tell us whether you were working at the facility you were pushing the cart. Um, if you were, then, then you're on the job and you'll have a workers' compensation claim there. Um, but in terms of the, uh, you know, any third party case against the owner of the lot or um, who is responsible for maintenance, you know, maintenance of the lot, it really depends on, you know, the size of the pothole. Um, and, you know, obviously if it was a huge crater, then you're probably not going to be able to make a recovery because it's open and open and obvious. But I mean, it really, we probably need some photographs and some more facts to really be able to make a determination on, on that one. Yeah, and we see a lot of these in the springtime, you know, after the winter. And this winter wasn't that bad, but people encountering these potholes. And we always tell people, you know, everyone has their phone. If you have your phone, it's a great investigative tool. So you can take your pictures, um, video, um, document your injuries, and, you know, make sure you always give notice to where you fell. And if you were working, make sure you give notice to your employer. So, I mean, a lot of issues, remember, notice, pictures, investigate, and make sure you see your doctors. And then finally pick up the phone and give us a call. All yeah. right, nice and easy, and they can talk to you during the quarantine and everything going on. Mm -hmm. Give them a call, guys. Thank you for your time. We'll see you next time. If you at home have more questions for the law on you, just go to pahomepage.com.